welcome to the 30 Second Telly Awards. It's really lovely so to have you here. Thanks. First of all, can you just give a brief introduction of yourself and the work that you do? Yes. Uh, my name is Natasha Frankenberg and I do work as a programmer for the International Women's Film Festival here in Germany. It takes place in uh, Dortmund and in uh, Cologne. And I am the programmer for the Begel Desired section. It's the queer film section of the festival. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Uh, so for the Women's Film Festival, uh, we have a very high number of uh, female filmmakers in the Tony yes, Award this year, that. which yeah. is really exciting. It is. Um, but that's not the case everywhere. So yeah. why is it that you think it's important to create a space for queer women filmmakers? Why is it important to create a space for... I mean, you just answered that in a way. <laughs> Can you give me more? <laughs> you, you just said that there's, like, on the major uh, film festivals, there's often, like, a, a few number of uh, women filmmakers in the big competition, and mm -hmm. then uh, um, there's and still a lack that of... Is? That is? Um, because of uh, the way our society is... Um, like structured by uh, still things like sexism and so on, and it's just like there's uh, there's still um, um, ways that um, make make it easier for uh, male directors to, to to reach a certain point and to um, to. to, to to, to get networked and to get like um, uh, like supported and so on, but but that's like like a really um, uh, I mean to answer that question you you would have to start yeah. like really <laughs> on the base and with education yeah. and the way we treat like women different from mm. men and uh, how after all. There's so much depends on this uh, binary of uh, gender or something, yeah. and that we uh, split people into two genders and so on. And yeah, and at the end, um, it also affect, it, it affects many things, and it also affects like um, uh, professional filmmaking and uh, to reach certain positions that are powerful. Yeah. And then at the end, it's a question of power that was like kind of complicated the way I <laughs> answered it, no, but it's, it's just because it's so... It's a complicated it's, question. Yeah, and it's like, it's not so easy. It, you, 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 you say it's like quite... Uh, you would say that it's quite easy to answer, probably, but it, it, like, it, uh, it begins, so you, you have to really um, think of uh, sexism and so on as a, as a structure of yeah. society and, yeah. And I believe you also have quite an academic background, so yes. you've done a lot of study of film mm -hmm. and queer film. Uh, can you tell us a little bit more about that? About my academic background, um, I've been working on um, the discussion of temporality in queer studies, and I had a look from a, um, um, from a film scholar perspective on it, and I, I was uh, thinking that th there's a lack of considering the, the documentary films in that discussion, and uh, um, I was um, looking at their um, at documentaries and say that, that it's uh, like important to um, also consider the positions that the films make themselves, not just to... Um, Take them as a material for for the research, but to also say what what theoretical positions do they produce when it comes to temporality? Because film is such a um, time-based medium, and yeah, that that was my academic background. Okay. <laughs> and how do you think the combination of that academic background and your work in the Women's Film Festival will help you in your role as a Teddy juror? I don't know if it will help me. It will probably make it also complicated. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, um, but it will like um, it will lead to my view, like being interested in feminist issues, being interested in um, in the question what a queer film um, 
is or what we um, categorize as queer yeah. cinema and um, and it also combines questions of um, what um, what a queer style and what aesthetics, what what politics are uh, brought together in film and yeah, things like that. <laughs> Thank you very much. It was really interesting and uh, enjoy the rest of the Berlin Island. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs>